In this lesson, you will learn about taking numbers from standard form to expo exponent form. Okay, so if we have the number 100, standard form is 100. We can break this up into factors, prime factors. And when we do that, 4 times 25 is 100, and then we can split 4 into 2 times 2, and 25 into 5 times 5. So 2 times 2 times 5 times 5 is 100. This is a standard form. These are the prime factors. And then I can take the prime factors and write them in exponent form. And what I do is I look at these numbers. These numbers are all bases. So there's a base of a 2, and I count how many 2's are there. There's 1, 2, 2's. So my base is 2, and the exponent is also 2. There are two 2's. We multiply that by another base. Well, the base is 5. How many of those 5's are there? Well, there's 2. So this is 2 to the second power times 5 to the second power, or 2 times 2 times 5 times 5. And if you were to multiply that all back out, you get 100. So 100 in standard form is 2 to the second power times 5 to the second power. Or you could say 2 squared times 5 squared. Okay. 360. If you do all the work, the prime factors of 360 are 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 3 times 5. We can then write that in exponent form. I see a base of 2, and I count how many 2's. 1, 2, 3 of them. The exponent is 3. Multiplied by a base of 3. How many 3's are there? Well, there's 1, 2, so the exponent is 2. Multiplied by a base of 5. Well, how many are there? There's only 1, so I just leave it as 1, 5, a base of 5. So 360 in exponent form is 3 to the third power times, sorry, 2 to the third power times 3 to the second power times 5. Okay. Here's this big long number, 555,660. If we do the prime factorization of that, we get 2 times 2 times 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 times 5 times 7 times 7. So the same process, we're going to take each base, I see a base of 2, and I count the number of times there are, is a 2, and there are 2, so the exponent is 2. Times, I see another base of 3, how many 3's are there? 1, 2, 3, 4. This time it's an exponent of 4. Times the next base, which is 5, how many? There's just one, so I leave it as 5, and I see another base of 7, and I see that there are two sevens, so seven has an exponent of two. So 555,660 in exponent form is two to the second power times three to the fourth power times five times seven to the second power. That's the end of our lesson on standard form to exponent form.